We are currently in the midst of the sixth extinction event in the history of the planet. Now, the difference between this extinction event and the five previous ones is that the five previous ones were natural events. They occurred as a result of something that happened in nature. But this extinction event is being driven by our activities. We are the ones that are causing this mass die-off of species around the planet. Speaking from a personal experience, when we came here over 25 years ago, there were jackals everywhere, and you could hear them calling through the night. And they were the key predator that kept the overpopulation of wild boar down because they used to catch the excess babies. Wild boar are prolific breeders. When an ecosystem is properly balanced and you've got predator and prey balance, a wild boar will only have one or two babies survive. And the jackal in this area were the key predator that helped to keep that balance. The ginger farmers put the ginger root in poison before putting it into the ground because they knew wild boar liked to dig it up and eat the ginger root. They were trying to stop them from eating it. But what they didn't count on was when the boar would eat the poison ginger root, the boar would die. And then the jackal would eat the dead body and the jackal would die. So now throughout this entire district, the Indian jackal is virtually extinct. Poisoned as a consequence of us using poison on our own agricultural food stuff. Now, as a result of the jackal dying off and being poisoned out, the wild boar population actually exploded. And this created a lot of human animal conflict between planters and farmers and the boar, who now, without any kind of predatorial control from the jackal, overpopulated. So you can see how critically important predators are in order to keep that balance. And you can see how a species can become extinct by something man does without understanding or thinking about its full consequences. So this is an example of human-driven extinction of a species.